Now, a lot of the times when we have backups, y'all call us and, and we'll come out regardless of, of for the call if it's y'all backed up. But the, when it becomes a city problem, if, if, if you have water over here and it's all full and I've come and opened mine and it's completely dry, that's going to kind of give me an idea that from right here on to your house, the problem's going to be somewhere in there. Now, if I came to the clean out and to my clean out and opened it right when I got there and this is full of water, that's going to tell me from right here down to my main or even my main could be broke, obstructed, have roots, etc. I just wanted to give you an idea on how that works on when it falls into the hands of the homeowner's problem. Well, over here I have my jetter hose. This is how we clean our mains, our sewer mains. We'll slide this through and we'll turn our water pressure on. And what this does right here on this head has water squirting back and forward. But when we go in forward, the real work starts when we come pulling back. Because we start pulling back and we're pulling everything that's you know, in the sewer main that could be obstructing it. As far as our vacuum, right here, this big tube, this is our vacuum, and this comes in handy a lot. It helps, I mean, a ton. Uh, it also goes with our jetter. We'll have it in the manhole at the same time while we're jetting back, so it's just sucking everything up instead of just keeping it right there in the manhole. But this thing is a very, very powerful vacuum. We dig with our wand over here and this what we do is we spray at the same time it, it, also, it works good for the utilities that are around us like the flags that are around us that we'll have gas lines right next to our sewer or y'all service line or we'll even have our water lines right next to it so this is real good with, we don't have to dig with a tractor and you know, this thing does all the digging i'm gonna demonstrate it after i show you all the cameras and stuff um but it's very powerful and, and i'm gonna expose it all this pipeline right here but i'm gonna come over here to these cameras this big camera right here is very very helpful for us sometimes at times this goes to our big sewer mains the ones that we have in the middle of the street we'll drop this camera into a manhole and we're able to just maneuver mm-hmm Do you have a camera at the end of that over yes, there? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Actually, you know what? That's the one that inspects the sewer. I can pull it out. Oh, sure. <laughs> so everybody can see it. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. You can turn the camera. Big boy. Turn the lights right there. Yeah. That is the camera then. Yep. Oh, yeah. You know, I've never done that, but that's his name. <laughs> they call him Bob. I'm insulted. <laughs> <laughs> and my other camera that I have, uh, and I'll get to it, I just wanted to drive to this real quick. I'm assuming that'll track how many feet it yes, goes man. in. Yes, sir. So it'll, 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 it's got a counter right there yeah, on this side. Okay. And this camera right here, my push camera I use for service line. I'll drop it in, you know, mine or even yours at times to kind of, you know, if I if I unblock you, because if I show up and y'all call, I'm I'm not gonna leave. Even though it's y'all's, I mean, won't leave y'all blocked up. I'll, I'll block it out, you know. And 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 I, at times I'll run my camera through there, and, and I have a locator as well. I'll, I'll throw a flag down where the problem is, you know, so in case I do need to call a plumber or treat it whatever way you are able to, that helps a lot too. You but, can't 